What's going on guys? I am Azim and welcome back to another new cool and exciting video. This video is going to be very exciting because in this video I'm gonna tell you the specifications and some features of brand new Huawei P30 Pro that has not yet released but it's coming in the last of this month. So we will also talk about the release date later in this video. So stay tuned with me and watch this video till end. And we will also take a look at the things in the P30 Pro that had been upgraded comparing it to the previous model that was P20 Pro. So now let's start it with the display. So the Huawei P30 Pro is going to have the display size of 6.5 inches that is an OLED display along with that the resolution is 2340 by 1080 pixels but here we have a little upgradation as compared to the p20 pro because p20 pro have 2240 by 1080 pixels of screen resolution and the screen size is 6.1 inches so here the p30 pro has a little bit of size greater than the p20 pro and also another thing that p30 pro will have a water drop notch display that looks stunning than the notch that p20 pro had so huawei is doing their best in improving the displays now next we have the chipset specs so p30 pro will have the latest high silicon kirin 980 processor that is really very fast as we had already seen its performance on the recent released flagships from huawei like mate 20 pro mate x and some other flagships if we talk about the speed of processor then it will be 2.6 gigahertz and here also the processor has been upgraded from p20 pro that had Kirin 970 with clock speed of 2.36 gigahertz and next we have the storage so p30 pro will have the internal storage of 128 gigabytes and ram of 8 gigabytes and there will be no memory card slot as per leaks but i think that there will be a card slot because 128 gig is not enough for some people so if there will be no card slot Huawei should include that card slot in the P30 Pro. And if we talk about the operating system, then P30 Pro will be running on the Android 9.0 Pi and it will have the USB Type-C port. And talking about the sensors, so P30 Pro will have that all sensors that other flagships have nowadays like accelerometer, proximity sensor, magnetometer, ambient light, gyroscopic sensor and GPS. And yes, there is also another question rising on internet that will P30 Pro have the fingerprint sensor then I think that yes it will have an in display fingerprint sensor so now let's see that what Huawei is planning to set up and there is also a bad news that you will have to use a dongle to use your earphones because P30 Pro is not gonna have that 3.5 mm audio jack yes P30 Pro is getting rid of that 3.5 mm audio jack and this is really not good it's very disappointing and p30 pro will have dual sim slots and the battery capacity of p30 pro will be 4300 mAh that is really good but not so much good as nowadays all the flagships are coming with huge batteries and p30 pro will also support fast charging as it has the usb type c port and now here we have the last thing and i know that you're also waiting for that camera setup of p30 pro is going to be just the best camera setup i think p30 pro is coming up with the quiet camera setup at the back and single camera setup at the front so this is also the one main thing that has been upgraded if we compare it to the p20 pro so the back camera setup will be super damn cool as first camera will have the 48 megapixel of sensor the second one will have the 28 megapixel of sensor third one will have 13 megapixel of sensor and the fourth camera will have the 5 megapixel of sensor and the front facing camera will be of 24 megapixels and if we talk about the modes that these cameras will have so 
that will be the autofocus phase detection auto flash continuous shooting exposure compensation phase detection geotagging iso control touch to focus white balance presets and the other camera features are phase detection autofocus flash dual led flash and the simple autofocus option and now let's talk a bit more about the back cameras as their complete specs has not been released but we have some leaks so as in this image you can see a moon magnified to a very long range this is the image that was shared by richard yu who is the ceo of huawei's customer business group he took a shot of the moon and shared the image on weibo to celebrate lantern festival with a weird attempt at blurring the most relevant bits of watermark instead of just having turned it off completely from the camera app's settings. In spite of this, we can tell that second line says like a quad camera, while the obscured word in the first line is way too short for it to be made 20, so absolutely it cannot be made 20. I think that it is the P30. Anyways, this picture of moon is just insane and makes sense that cameras of P30 Pro are the cameras we need. And then here we have another picture that is just official showing that the release date of P30 Pro is 26th March of 2019. And did you notice the hidden twist in the picture? If not, then listen carefully and look carefully. In this image, the lens showing the magnified image of Eiffel Tower that is also a symbol of insane long range camera of P30 Pro. Yes, and there are some other samples of P30 Pro camera you can see. I think that these are captured by 5x or 10x optical zoom lens of P30 Pro. So that's all for today, but this is not the end. The we will get the exact specs and other values of p30 pro soon or on the 26th of the march when it is going to be released in paris so i hope that you would have enjoyed the video if you did then smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching